It's the least wonderful time of the year. Flu season is in full effect, and if you haven't caught it yet, you're one of the lucky ones. The Centers for Disease Control is reporting widespread flu activity in 30 states, Texas included. This year, the H1N1 strain, also known as swine flu, is responsible for a majority of these cases. United Regional treated 570 patients with the flu this time last year. So to make sure us Texomans don't run into another harsh flu season, hardworking physicians like Dr. Dr. Christopher Godwin are making sure we stay informed. You know, first of all, it's a virus and it kind of tends to mutate every year, so it means it's always changing and that's why we need to get a new flu vaccine every year to kind of keep up with the mutations. And so really our goal is to prevent people from getting the virus, but once you have it, uh, no antibiotics going to cure that. So what exactly does a flu vaccine do for the body? Well, according to the CDC, it causes antibodies to develop about two weeks after vaccination. These antibodies provide protection against infection with the viruses that are already in the vaccine. And the biggest misconception about getting the flu shot is that when you get a shot, you get sick. It takes education and persistence. And I even tell them things about my own experience. You know, we've got a beautiful eight-month-old daughter. She got her flu vaccine. Um, my wife's pregnant right now and she got her flu vaccine and so I'm not telling the community to do something that we don't do in our own family. And if you do catch the flu, United Regional has ways to treat you away from crowded emergency rooms. Rather than showing up in a public place where other people may have the flu, you could at least take one step to avoid that and uh, log into our e-care system and potentially speak to a physician and um, tell them your symptoms and maybe get some treatment.